Yeah! We've been fixing here this morning. Oh, the guy is laughing here. <laughs> Power! So yeah, we've been fixing here this motor here. Uh, this is a Mac motor. Boy, this customer here in Australia. So we're just replacing this little hole sensor, man. Got some epoxy glue here and all that. And then found out that this little hole sensor here was the issue. So all I did, I just uh, work out the way to unglue this epoxy uh, circuit board here. And then I soldered a new one that Paul sent to us. This is a Honeywell uh, nice uh, hole sensor, right? So he sent so many, man. So many have this for life, man. Check out. Really nice, Paul. Thanks so much. Send the epoxy glue, everything here. So this is the little hole sensor, man. This is a Honeywell. Really, really good brand, okay? Uh, but this one, unfortunately, was got some problem or something. So normally the hole sensors, they, they sense the polarity change here, okay? So the magnet moves here. And then they tell the motor, oh, it's, oh, the motor is moving this direction, and this is happening at this speed and all that. And then, oh, it senses and send a pulse to the controller, say 0 or 5 volts. Okay, but this one is actually constantly stuck at 3.75 volts or something like that. So this was the problem here, the yellow one here, right there, okay? So I just replaced that. You have three legs here, right? So one leg is positive, one leg is negative, the other leg is an output. So that's the one you measure 5 volts or 0. Very simple, man. And this thing is just, ah, oh, beautiful. So that's the controller that comes with the motor, right? So, so many wires here. This is how it came to us, uh, missing the housing for the connector, for the whole sensor connectors here, okay? So we don't want to send like this. There's a high chance of getting a short circuit and blow the whole sensor again. So we're just going to put some high go plugs here, okay? So well, we only need a five pin connector. So the high go plug, we actually have five pin connector here, right? So we're just going to, Oh, uh, there's some soldering job here. We're gonna see how it looks. Oh, down here, man. Check out. Oh, high go plug, man. 5P. Oh, much better connection. Oh, yeah. Ah. Uh, we're more familiar with the buffet controller. So I just uh, like a look the buffet uh, hole sensors here and kind of like work out, work out a way. And then just rewire here and then did some tests here, right? So, so check out the speed that this thing is going, man, with the buffet controller. Whoa. Oh, it's going pretty fast, man. Check out the gears here. Oh, check out this thing. <laughs> so much power, man! Thanks, Paul! You rock! 